Wow, praise God, kids. Welcome for our show today. We have many so things. We have many things for you. We have Bible stories. We have songs. We have memory verses. Hope you will enjoy. Make sure that you stay with us until the end. Make sure that you have your Bible and a notebook so that you can note down something that you will heard from our lesson for today. Hope you will be blessed. And before we start, I have my small friend here. She wants to pray for us. Now let's close our eyes. She's going to pray. Our oh, Father, what in heaven, our Lord, in thy name, the kingdom come. The will done on earth as it in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as he forgive those who trespass against us. These are not temptation, but leave us of the evil for that is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Wow, amen. Let's clap for my little friend. She's good. Na opata wea nyumbani hapo umejifunza kitu. Thank you. So karibuni tuanse nasi usi ondoke adi tamati na utaweza kubarikiwa. Nina mpenda Bwana Yesu Nina mpenda Amen Nina mpenda Bwana Yesu Nina mpenda Amen Watoto wa ukoka Amen Kwa jina lake Amen Na huyu Yesu Amen Asifiwe Teach. I have a memory verse from the book of Hebrews 13, verse 1. It says, keep on loving each other as brothers and sisters. Thank you. My name is Jasmine. I have a memory verse. Philippians 2, verse 4. It says, look for one another. Interest is not just, it's not, it's not just for your own. 
My name is Fitel Kibet and I have a memory verse. Amos 3 verse 3, it says, can two people to work together if they don't agree? My name is Era Cherop and I have a memory verse from the book of Psalms 27 verse 1. It says, the Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? My name is John and I am Joy and we have a song. There is a candle in every soul, some brightly burning, some dark and cold. There is a spirit who brings the fire, ignites a candle and makes it glow. Carry a candle, run to the Seek out the hopeless, confused and torn. Hold out your candle for all to see. Take your candle, go light your wall. Take your candle, go light your world. Thank you. Hi people, I'm going to take you through this lesson. I'm teacher Linda, and today's lesson will be about Jesus feed 5,000 people. And before we start any lesson, we'll start with a word of prayer. Let's pray. Everlasting Father, we come over this time, O oh Lord. I thank you, O oh Lord, for guiding us throughout the day. When we're going to start this lesson, help us to understand and listen to the teacher. I pray this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. As I've said, today's lesson is about Jesus feed 5,000 people. It is in the book of John 6, 1 to 15. Are you ready to listen? Yes. yes. Are you ready to listen to the word of God? Yes. yes. Okay, I'm going to tell you about what Jesus did, a miracle what Jesus did. <coughs> Let's start. Jesus was crossing in the Sea of Galilee where he saw many people. Imagine, imagine, yesu aliona watu wengi sana. Vila ya alishuka tu hivi kwa bot. Eh, hakaona watu wengi. Watu wengi wanakimbia kwa ke. Eh, Jesus was very amazed. These old people are running to me. Uneza niambia mbona yesu, watu alikuwa nakimbia kumona yesu. Mineza wambia. People had heard many stories about Jesus, like... Like, like the miracles which Jesus performed. You can tell me some of the miracles which Jesus performed. He changed water into wine. He changed water into wine. Good. He, any person? He healed the paralyzed man. He healed the blind man. He raised someone from the dead. He? He rose? He raised someone from the dead. He raised someone from the dead. That shows that Jesus is very good. He, whenever we, he, whenever we are in, we are in any problem, he is there for us. Sindio. So Jesus, um, so Jesus was was in the point when many people were in the field, in the mountainside. Eh, then he asked Philip. Philip, Philip was the disciples of Jesus, and Jesus alikuwa uh, metembea na disciples wake. Eh, hey, akaita Philip, Philip kuja hapa. Philip akakuja, akamwambia, Philip, unaona watu wote wanakaa ni kama wako na njaa. Imagine, imagine ni umeenda shule, umekuja jioni, au hujapata kitu yote kwa kwa nyumba, unasikia njaa. Sikutasikia vibaya. Hasa watu walikuwa hapo na njaa, wanataka kusikia the word of God. And people were eagerly waiting to hear about the word of God. Walikuwa wamesikia maneno mingi yenye Mungu amesema na walikuwa wanataka sasa kumuona akiperform some of the miracles yenye atenda kuperform hapo. Sasa people were eagerly, eagerly, eagerly waiting to hear the word of God. Sasa Yesu akaambia Philip, "Nona watu wote wanasikia nja. Kuna watoto hapo, kuna wamama, kuna wababa. Some of the people hapo kulikuwa na watoto wadogo. Watoto wadogo wanaweza kaa a long time without food." Apana si ndio? Watoto watoto wadogo hizi kaya a long time without food. 
Asa Mungu alikuwa anahurumia akauliza Philip, "Eh Philip akuwa na answer, akasema tunaweza feed na nini?" Philip akuwa na any any response ya kuambia Jesus, but Jesus alikuwa na solution, but akuwa anataka ku kuambia Philip. Alikuwa anajua all these people wanaweza wa feed with my miracle. Si nimesema Jesus al perform many miracles. Yes. Ndio. Yes. Yes. Hiyo inaonyesha nini? Hiyo inaonyesha nini vile Yesu al perform many miracles. Si anatuonyesha vile anatupenda, si ndio? Yes. Anatuonyesha how he was very kind to us, how he was his good to us every day. Tukikuwa wagonjwa, nani anatutibu? Unaenda hospitali, si ndio? Yes. Unaenda usi lakini Mungu anatumia powers yake ku kukutibu, si ndio? Yes. Sasa hivyo nenda kuambia about vile Yesu alifanya. Alafu kulikuwa na another disciple. Si tumongelea Philip, kulikuwa yes. na another disciple. Kam, alikuwa anaitwa Andrew. Alikuwa anaitwa Andrew. Akakuja na solution. Akasema, "Wa, ni kama nimeona kijana mmoja. Ako na five loaves of bread and two fish." Jesus akasema, "Yes, that is the best idea." Aka, aka, akaita watu akaita disciples wake akaambia sasa sinaona watu vile wamekaa tu hivyo vile wako put people into group akaambia sasa mweke watu into different groups 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 ndio naweze kunini kufanya nini kufanya the miracle eh hey, people were shocked kasama yes eventually tumeona miracle yenye Yesu atafanya this is one of the miracles yenye Yesu atafanya eh hey, people were very happy at ingekuwa ungekuwa among those people wenye walikuwa nasikia njaa wenye walikuwa nasikia wengine walikuwa wagonjwa walikuwa nataka healing from god but mungu akawasaidia si ndio yes ingekuwa ungefanya nini ungefurahi vile yesu amesema he will be the solution of the problem yes vile yes. umesikia njaa si ndio yes mimi najua mungefurahi mungefurahi sana alafu After hapo waka Jesus aka feel the akaombea before ata a feel the the basket with bread and fish before aka give thanks to God. Kwa kila kitu yenye unafanya, children, kila kitu yenye unafanya before you do anything, before you start your exam, you start your day, you go to bed, you should first pray vile Yesu aliomba. Yesu before ata a, a a multiply the bread and fish aliomba kwanza aliomba baba yake aweze kumsaidia he prayed to god na because he trusted him so much akaomba the then the bread multiply eh watu sasa walikuwa wamekaa kwa groups watu wamekaa kwa groups disciples wakaenda wakaanza kufanya nini ku distribute different wakaanza ku distribute bread and fish. Si ndio si nimesema hivyo? Wakaanza yes. ku distribute nini? Bread, bread and, and fish. fish yenye yenye ali yenye ule mtoto mdogo mwenye alikuwa nayo waka multiply. Mesikia? Yes. <coughs> Sasa hivyo vile ame distribute watu wakaanza kukula, wenye hata walikuwa wamanza kukua wagonjwa, wamanza kukua dizzy, wakaanza kukula, wakashiba. Eh hey, people were very happy. Imagine ulikuwa na njaa alafu kule ushibe sitafurahi. Yes. Watu wakafurahi, eh hey, wakafurahi, wakashukuru Mungu, wakasema this is this is this is God, our our real God. Tunamsikianga lakini leo tumeona maajabu yenye amefanya, si ndio? Yes. yes. So from today's lesson, what have you learned? Always trust in God. Always trust in God. Always trust in God. Vile Yesu ali 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 trust kwa hiyo ali trust in his prayers akaomba ndio the bread and fish can multiply. Yes. We should always share, sindo? Always share with your friend. If you have something, something like two pen, two books, share with your friend or your neighbor. Obey God. You should always pray God. Vile Yesu ali pray God, ali give thanks to God. Yes.
Yes. Have faith in God. You should always have faith in God. Everything you do in this life, you should have faith in God. Ata ukiwa shule. Ukiwa shule, ununa before ata ufanya exam, ticha kikufunza. You should always trust in God. Everything will be possible if you trust in God. Masikia? Asa, back to the story, vile Yesu ali... Alilisha watu, watu, siniwe sama watu alifurai. Hey, ata mi yes. nge kwa po, nge furai, hey, I will be very happy. Alafu, imagine, yo, inone, inone hizo bread na fish, imagine ilitosha kila mtu. Wana imagine ilitosha kila mtu? Imagine watu walikuwa wengi, over 5,000 people. Sika watu ni wengi sana? Yes. Ata church, this church even is small. Kwa hii filiote, watu wameja, wameja, over 5,000 people. Hey. That is very marvelous, I think so. And naisitoshe, watu walikula, wakakula, ali wakashiba, until again, nini ikabaki? Bread ikabaki. The bread, the leftover ikabaki. Ilikuwa imebaki ngapi? Nani anajua? Yes? 12 baskets. Yes, ilikuwa imebaki 12 buckets of loaves yenye ilikuwa imebaki. Alafu, those breads by the way were very sweet. Imagine kitu enye, something enye God ame change, ame change something, yani ame multiply something, so that something is very sweet. Mna kumbuka ngele story ya vile Jesus change water into wine. Yes. It is just in a relate, sindo? Sina relate vile vitu ilishia watu, lakini kisasa na multiply, sindo? Yes. So from the from today's lesson we learn that we should trust God. We should put everything to God. At in different difficult situation in which we are undergoing in life. We should always pray to God vile Mungu aliomba. Aka trust in God. Na Mungu anatupenda sana. Naona vile ali aona watu wa kinini. Vile watu walikuwa wamesikia njaa, aliona vile watoto wameteseka, watoto wanalia. Alijua apa, if God is good. So we'll, hand, we'll wind up with a memory verse from the book of Philippians 4 verse 19. Let's say Philippians 4 verse 19. Philippians 4 verse 19. My God will supply all your needs. My God will supply all your needs. Philippians 4 verse 19. Philippians 4 verse 19. My God will supply all your needs. My God will supply all your needs. So today I will, I will leave you with something, with a, with a, something to tell you that you should trust, you should always trust in God and you should always pray. Let's pray as we wind up the lesson. Our everlasting Father, we come over this time, O oh Lord. I thank you, Lord, for enabling us to listen to this lesson until we are finishing, O oh Lord. Help us so that we may put it in our daily lives. Amen. Wow, we have come to the end of our show today. Hope you have learned something about Jesus fed 5,000 people. Hey, how you can imagine Jesus feeding 5,000 feeding 5, people with what? Two fish and five loaves of bread. What a miracle. So, hope you found something good up. Now, taweza kusau, uweza kubarikiwa sana. Hope you have not, you are, you have write your short notes down 
your notebook ndio uweze kusomanga za zile uko free so tumebarikiwa na before we end our show nitawaomba sasa tutaomba and then tukimaliza usimame penye uko hapo nyumbani uweze ku dance na sinao let's pray my everlasting father king of glory we thank you father for the gift of life and protection that will be with us oh lord since we start our show until the end oh lord lord i want to pray for the sick in hospital their homes that you may give them medicine from the above oh lord for the travelers give them safe journey my king of glory lord i want to pray for this children father may you bless them may you guide them father as they are growing to know your word king of glory may you bless them and guide them king of glory father may you guide us and lead us till we meet in the next show and our glory shall be unto you for i pray this short prayer believing and trusting in jesus name i do pray and believe amen which show is this best